Awesome. So I'm here with Mitch from Photo Fun Spot. Mitch, I'm curious to hear from you. Why did you d decide to invest in Booth Mastermind and buy a ticket? You know, I've been been going to a lot of different conventions over the years and looking for something that's a little bit more higher educational, a little bit taking my education a little bit further, skill set a little bit further, looking for something to help uh, hone my sales skills. Um, you know, just that kind of better business, better business skills, better business. But you options. mentioned you've been going to a few conventions. Is so, there? Do you see a gap? Like, is there a need for more premium education? Like, I think there definitely is. Um, you know, a lot of the conventions are, you get like a 45 minute, maybe a 30 minute uh, spiel from somebody. And a lot of times it's it's very specific to a product that they have or that they, you know, that they market or own. And so um, it tends to be, you know, sort of, you got blinders, mm. uh, you know, you get, you don't get the scope that you have uh, from those kinds of uh, events. What about in terms of the networking? Do you value that as well as the education, the, the people that you meet so, there? Networking is definitely a big thing. Um, I was just noticing, you know, we're here at the WNBA and uh, it's a very different from the PBX that I'm used to going to because I don't know anybody except like six people here that are like doing this recording right now. Um, but it's funny because those six people that also invest in going to this, that's a sign of that they'll probably be successful in the future. Right. They're investing in themselves or going to these events. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So uh, the networking is great, uh, especially, you know, like a PBX is like, you know, everybody and yeah. and uh, you get a chance to hang out and catch up with everybody once a year. And, and you mentioned that specifically like sales skills. Is there specific things that you're looking to learn? Is there certain things that's holding you back right now that you're looking to learn? I, I like being able to uh, be a little bit smarter about that and um, you know, being able to interact with my customers in a way that minimizes the number of decisions they have to make, minimizes the amount of conversation that we're having, minimizes the amount of time that we're both spending on, you know, making that booking. And uh, you, just kind of getting to the point. Yeah. You've mentioned that you've been to a lot of these things. <clears throat> you seem like you're someone that's constantly doing investment in your self-education. For people, people that are listening that are considering, like, should I go to this one, should I go to that one? How do you advise them to make a decision? Boy, that's that's a tough one. Although right now I feel like there's not a lot of offerings in the, in the higher space, right? You've got um, you've got a lot of your little the conventions that have like the 30 and 45 minute talks or speeches or, or little presentations, but not something that's like an all day. Uh, let's get down, let's get into the weeds and really like work through and talk about business and 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 improve our you know our skills and our education. Yeah. So I. That's part of the reason I chose uh, this particular event is I like the idea that we're gonna we get two days and we're gonna spend a lot of you know all day together working through all these things rather than just you know thirty minutes is enough to kind of get things rolling and then it's done yeah and it's time to wrap up. That's a common uh, comment that I've heard that people can't really get into the meat of things yeah. in that sort of a presentation. Yeah. So, all right, bitch. Thank you for taking the time to chat with us and hopefully it lives up to your expectations. Absolutely. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Thank yeah. you. It was really good to meet you.